Hi, everyone. Thanks for checking out your morning update to your daily forecast. I'm meteorologist Mike Witcher. We made it to Sunday, and it's still kind of a cloudy, overcast, dreary, damp start to the day. It won't be that way all day long, although we do have a chance for a couple of passing showers. So we'll see increasing high clouds throughout the day tomorrow. On Monday, as we track our next storm system, that's going to bring rain back into the area Monday night and Tuesday, falling temperatures Tuesday afternoon, and maybe a chance for some light snow showers. Across the higher terrain on into our Wednesday. So getting us out the door on this good old Sunday morning. Uh, temperatures haven't fluctuated a whole lot over the last 24 hours. We're now in the 30s. We'll climb into the low 40s by noon today. Again, can't rule out a couple of passing light showers, maybe a, a flurry here or there, a snow shower across the higher elevations, but no travel troubles whatsoever. As we get into the afternoon and evening hours, Notice the clouds will start to break up some. I think that's probably going to be closer to about 4, 5, 6, and 7 o'clock here tonight. So don't expect a ton of sunshine. Uh, and temperatures will top out in the mid to upper 40s. Into the evening hours, 5 o'clock we're at 42, 9 o'clock down to 37 degrees. Clearing skies overnight tonight. That's going to allow for a cold start to our Monday morning. Morning low temperatures will dip down to the 20s and 30s to get the work week started. And then through the day on Monday, plenty of sunshine on the way. But here comes our next storm system, and we'll start to see the effects of that based on watches and warnings. The National Weather Service has issued a high wind watch from Monday evening through Tuesday evening for the Smoky Mountains. We're talking winds out of the southeast, uh, 40 to 50, gusting possibly to upwards of 80 miles per hour. So a big time wind with that next system on the way. So Monday we'll see increasing clouds across the area. Most of the rain is going to come through during our Monday night and Tuesday morning, making for a soggy start to our Tuesday. Heaviest rain is going to be for the first part of the day, falling temperatures for the second part of the day, and then those rain showers will exit with the possibility of some light snow on the backside. It is going to produce a lot of rain. Uh, we're talking anywhere from most, say generally speaking, about an inch to two inches. In some locations, other locations may not get quite as much, but definitely a big rainmaker. Could see some thunderstorms out of the storm system as well, not to mention maybe a light coating of snow as we head through the day on Wednesday and notice the horseshoe effect mainly across the higher terrain. That should be about the extent of that. All right, so your three-day forecast today, we're at 44, 51 degrees tomorrow, 58 on Tuesday. Early high temperature, though, falling afternoon temperatures as the cold air comes racing on in. Oh, and by the way, another one of these storms is expected to arrive as we get into our, say, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday of next weekend. So make sure you check back in. We sure hope you have a great rest of your Sunday.